Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I wanted to film my December favorites, as you can already tell by the title. This video will probably not be going up in December, so with that being said, Happy New Year! I didn't do my November favorites last month because, to be honest, I didn't have much. I probably had like two things. I didn't really play around or dabble into a ton of different makeup last month, so I kind of just completely skipped over that video, not to mention I got really sick. So for this video, I'm going to be mentioning the products that I loved in November and the ones that I loved this month, but without further ado, let's get cracking and let's get started. This, is, this goes into skincare, and this is the Dermalogica Pre-Cleanse. And this thing, let me tell you, it is almost magical how quick this thing removes your makeup. Like, I really do struggle a lot with after I film videos and stuff like that, and whenever I'm wearing heavy makeup, I really do dread taking it off because everybody knows how difficult it is to take off your mascara, and liquid lipstick is out the door. It's freaking hard as hell. It can get really time-consuming, and it can be a really big hassle to remove dark makeup or just a lot of makeup in general. It's 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 dreadful. This thing has really changed my skincare routine and my makeup removal routine. It really has made the world of a difference in my routine in general. I learned about this from Desi Perkins um, from her Snapchat. She snapped it and it was crazy what it did to her makeup. She literally had like a super bold lip and literally by the drop she swirled it on her lip and it was gone. Like gone 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 and it was crazy how fast it was like mind you this was snapchat she was able to do all of that in like the 10 seconds that snapchat gives you to like show whatever it is that you're doing i thought it was crazy and i was like look no further i'm done i'm buying it it's mine sold but it is it's an oil and that's why it's able to remove your makeup so quickly but i just think that some of the ingredients in this is also great to cleanse your face too not just to remove the makeup this thing really does do a really good job at just melting the makeup off of your face it's phenomenal it's great and i'm pretty sure i'm not going to stop using this the next product i wanted to mention i am wearing right now this is by ofra cosmetics and it is the havana nights collab with kathleen light's liquid lipstick oh my god oh my god Okay, I have like I have really I I I really don't have words for this liquid lipstick. If you haven't gotten it, you really should be getting your hands on it. It is the perfect burgundy deep red color, perfect for the winter. It just suits so many different skin tones. It looks so good whether you're wearing a full face of makeup, minimal makeup, or absolutely no makeup. It looks amazing regardless. And I've seen it on so many different skin tones and it complements everybody so well and so beautifully. I think this color is so great. She hit it spot on when she created this color. But can I just say the formula is amazing. It's super hydrating. It's long lasting. Like I get so much longevity out of this. The formula is great. It's honestly one of the best liquid lipsticks I've tried. Love it, love it, love it. And again, this is in the shade Havana Nights. I don't know if it's limited edition, but if it is or it isn't, I don't care. You still should get it. Like, get your hands on it. I'm about to buy a backup for when this runs out. Because it will. It will run out. I'm a little late to jump on this bandwagon, but I wanted to mention the Naked Skin Urban Decay Concealer. I'm very late, actually. I'm not a little bit late. I'm very late. <laughs> this is an absolutely amazing concealer, and it is just so perfect. So, to be honest, this is not my color. I'm going to have to go a shade deeper. I'm going to assume it's medium, not light medium. That's probably going to be my color, but I'm still going to keep this because I can tend to get a little bit paler throughout the winter, so I'm pretty sure it will be my color then, but right now it's still a little bit too light for me. And even with it being not my color, I still think it does a really good job at blending into my skin tone, and not a lot of concealers can do that. Like, but this one does such a good job at blending, it gives you full coverage. If you're on the lookout for a good concealer that doesn't crease, it's full coverage, and is really lightweight, this is your baby right here. The next product I wanted to mention, I'm not sure if I mentioned it in my previous favorites videos I don't think I have that's why I want to mention it now but you guys have heard me talk about it in my tutorials this is the wet n wild reservia cabana color icon bronzer but it's really a highlighter I've been using this highlighter non-stop I want to say all throughout November and December I've just been looking for something with a little bit more of a subtle glow on a day-to-day -day basis I don't really care for a lot a lot a lot of highlighter I just want more of like a subtle glow and this stuff is amazing it only costs like three bucks you get so much product it claims to be a bronzer but I would love to see the person that this could be a bronzer for because you would have to be almost transparent in skin color you'd have to be a ghost this is definitely a highlighter it looks very powdery initially but once you like really blend that into your skin it leaves a very sheer luminescent glow like it looks like you're glowing from within it's really a beautiful highlighter though it really is perfect for day-to-day -day basis perfect for women who don't care for highlighter but really want to start glowing a little bit more or maybe if you want to start trying highlighters 
but you don't really want to go from like 0 to 100 and try like a Becca highlighter off the bat because those can be really intense. Definitely try this out. It's amazing. It's from the drugstore, so the price is right. It's really, really good. I really stand by this, and I've been using it all throughout the month on a day-to-day -day basis for going to work and for just running everyday errands. It is absolutely amazing. This is the Vegas Nay Eyelore Shining Star Eyelashes. I wore these in my last tutorial. These lashes are so beautiful. I didn't want to wear them today because I want to talk about something else. Um, so I didn't want it to like obstruct the view of the other thing that I want to talk about. It really took me a while to get my hands on these because for some reason they were always sold out on Ulta whenever I tried to get them. And they never had them in the store. So, I mean, you can forget about that. But one day I was just walking around in Target and then I saw them. I saw this one and I saw the blue pair. I haven't tried the blue pair. I still have it there. I'll probably use it in one of my upcoming tutorials. So far, I really, really have been loving this one. It is a great pair of eyelashes. It is very, like, wispy and flirty. And they're really curly, too. Like, that's probably one thing that I really love about them. Most lashes are, but for some reason, these, I feel like the curliness in these is so prominent. Like, they really just go all the way up and they just look so pretty, so flirty. I wore them in my last tutorial, so if you have haven't seen it yet be sure to check that out I will have that link down below but yeah I really really love these eyelashes Vegas Nay hit it spot on these lashes are beautiful 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 and she did a great job another product that I recently got my hands on that I've been trying to get my hands on but I haven't been able to is this um Cody Airspun Loose Fun what Cordy A what the the next product that I wanted to mention is this Cody Airspun Loose Face Powder. I've been trying to get my hands on this for the longest time now, and I have not been successful at it up until recently. You guys are going to laugh at me when I tell you where I got this, but I got this at Kmart. Like, who goes to Kmart anymore? I'm sorry, who goes to Kmart? Makeup-wise, Kmart, it's, it's not where it's popping at all. So I found it so weird that I found it in Kmart. When I was Christmas shopping, I just... When you're Christmas shopping and you need to find things, you get desperate. You go into stores like Kmart. I went into Kmart and I found this. I found this in the makeup section and I almost lost my crap. But this stuff is really, really comparable to the Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. That powder is absolutely amazing. If you're into baking and if you're into setting your face with loose face powders, you need to try that powder out. But that can get very, very, very expensive. So... I mean, it is a pretty penny. Um, this stuff is pretty cheap, it's pretty inexpensive, and it is really, 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 really good. What I used to set my face today, and it just does a really good job at not letting my oils peek through. I have been getting very oily lately, I don't know why, but on my T-zone, and then especially like around my nose area, oh my god, I'm an oily craft bucket, it's disgusting. I've been using this product all throughout this month and it is really really good the only thing that I might say is kind of like a downfall to some people not to me is that it does have a fragrance the Laura Mercier doesn't really have a fragrance but this one it does have a pretty it does have a pretty potent perfumey fragrance that, that not a lot of people may like but I mean I can definitely look past that because it's not something that is uncomfortable to wear and I don't think it really lingers throughout your face I think you just smell it the first time you apply the product and then once it kind of just sets and you go about your day I don't think you smell it anymore so it doesn't really bother me if you have sensitive skin too I don't know how well this will do for you because of the fragrance factor if you get a crap ton of product and it's under seven bucks so I mean you can't go wrong with it check Kmart <laughs> I mean if you can't get it at your local Walmart check Kmart like I did I was lucky so I really really like this stuff so you should definitely check that out the next product I wanted to talk about is what I was trying to mention earlier for my eyelashes, uh, the L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black Mascara. Carly Bible swears by this mascara and several other YouTubers here, they absolutely love this stuff. And I've been having it and I do use it, I, it's not like my first time using it, but throughout this month, Honestly, I've only been using this mascara and I've been so happy with it. The wand is definitely key with this mascara. Like, it's super skinny and it's just the perfect precise wand. It does do a really good job at not letting them be clumpy and keeping them really black. And for the most part, it gives them good length for what I can achieve because I don't have long lashes. It is definitely an improvement for what my lashes normally look like. I was not blessed with really long, beautiful eyelashes like a lot of girls. But I have to work with what I got and I can't be wearing falsies every day, let's be honest. So this stuff really, really does a good job. I'm definitely going to have to repurchase. I did not take this product as serious as I do now because before I had um, my other favorite mascara that I was using that is actually discontinued. I, I was, I was going to have to move on at some point. I was going to have to move on and try something else that could work for me. And this definitely comes close. It's a really, really good mascara. I think this product goes into beauty, so I'm going to mention this. But this is the uh, Bath & Body Works Winter Candy Apple Fragrance. I absolutely love this little body spray. I've been spraying it so much. I'm going to spray it right now because I love it so much. 
but it smells so good it's super sweet and like mm, every time I wear it every time I wear it everybody always asks me what I'm wearing because it smells so good when I wear this and I go into work everybody's like oh my god that's a lease that's a lease because it it smells so good I'm pretty sure everybody got this around this time of year because I mean who doesn't get Bath & Body Works perfume for Christmas just saying I think it's a great gift that's just me I've been seeing a lot of people using this little body splash mist thingy but yeah I absolutely love it I have the lotion and I have the shower gel and it smells so good I could literally bathe in this and I literally do it's a very sweet and just very feminine fragrance so I really really love it for every day and yeah if you don't like sweet you probably won't like it but I absolutely love it so that's it guys that pretty much completes my favorites video for this month I hope you guys enjoy this video again I hope everybody has a very happy and healthy new year and I also wanted to thank you guys so much for your support I know I don't have like a lot of subscribers or anything but honestly I'm so grateful for the ones that I do have it really does mean a lot to me I'm trying so hard to do what I want to do and to do what I love and you guys are just reassuring to me when you watch my videos and you leave me sweet comments it really does mean the world to me so thank you so much thank you so much for the support thank you so much for the love I can only hope for more of that love and support for this upcoming year in 2016 with that being said thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed the video don't forget to leave me a thumbs up if you like the video and I will see you in my next video bye